This was personally revealed by Padam Safaka. It's that when your mouth talks nonsense or when you make vows but fail to fulfill them, you don't do what you say, your rewarded blessings will be lost. Nowadays, many people make vows as if they're daily eating. It's as normal as drinking water and talking nonsense every day. And there are countless people who lack integrity in their words. Therefore, when people eat their own words, predominant effects will result. The predominant effects are ripening in the form of external appearances. When you often speak without honoring your words, this kind of predominant effect becomes ripe. What will happen? The land turns barren and the food becomes nutrient deficient. Ripening in oneself through the constant suffering of the four great calamities, blessings and merits become shallow. Hence, in some countries or regions, just in that land, it can't grow good crops. There is not much harvest in that place. That place is often in poverty and deprivation, especially in modern society, say, for example, Taiwan. Taiwan is not a big place with over 23 million people, yet still many of them here find themselves lacking in this and that. Inconvenience to the private necessities, right? Why? This is your own predominant effects. In fact, you're suffering the retributive consequences. You're reaping what you have sown. And often, there are many disasters ripening on your own. This disaster will happen to you.